Mattresses, sleeping, back pain, disc bulges. What's the best type of mattress to sleep on? That's the focus of today's Ask Dr. Walter episode. This is episode number 16, folks, 16. And uh, what I do with this series is I, I upload a video each and every day, a short video. I'll take one of the actual questions in the comment section of my YouTube channel and I'll answer that question in a video format like this, okay? So it gives me an opportunity to put content on my channel and as well address you, my viewers, whether you're an existing uh, subscriber and follower on my channel or a new one. And if you're new, subscribe right now like this. You could get all my newest and latest videos that I put up about uh, taking care of the spine uh, with uh, stability and strengthening and corrective care. And of course, you can get to see these videos on a daily basis. So today's question in episode 16 is by Shanti, right here, okay, Shanti. So this is what Shanti asks. What kind of mattress do we use when we have disc diffusion bulge and nerve compression, okay? So it's a great question. And of course, the interest in this question is for this person's specific condition of diffuse uh, disc bulge and also nerve compression. But generally speaking, the mattress is going to be useful for someone with a disc bulge and nerve compression will be also useful for many other people, whether it's a back pain, leg pain, other conditions of the spine, and even neck pain and arm pain. Okay. So my preference and recommendations for my patients for mattress is a mattress that is firm, not soft, not even medium soft, okay? Firm with a pillow top, okay? That's what I would recommend. A nice firm mattress with a pillow top. So the pillow top will create some comfort and as well, the firmness of the mattress will keep your back well supported. And um, one of the best ways to sleep, actually two of the best ways to sleep would be either on your back or, or on your side with a good pillow under your neck that supports your neck curve into the lordosis, which the lordosis over here. So well supported um, and your head should not be too forward while you're sleeping. And of course, your back is nice and protected and supported on a firm mattress with a comfortable pillow top. Um, if you need extra support uh, for your lower back or relief of back symptoms and leg symptoms, then you can put one or two pillows under your knees. If you're a size sleeper, then you put a couple pillows between your knees, okay? So if you're looking for a new mattress at a mattress store, you can test them out. What I've noticed when I went to shop for my mattress is that if you're looking for a firm mattress, different manufacturers will have different levels of firmness. So you may go to three different manufacturers and their top firm mattress may actually feel a little bit different. So do test out different manufacturers um, and um, see which one is most comfortable for you. You don't want one that's too, 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 too firm like a board and you don't want one that's, you know, very soft. So a reasonably firm mattress with a comfortable pillow top is what I would recommend for anyone, especially for someone with back pain and disc injuries. That's the answer for today's episode of Ask Dr. Walter Salubro. And uh, again, uh, if you're new to this, subscribe. If you have a comment or question, ask it right now. And who knows, maybe your question may be featured next on the next episode of that Ask Dr. Walter Salubro. And if you missed the past episodes, you don't have to go on with not watching them. So just go right here to the playlist right there, right there, right there. You see it right there to catch some of the past episodes. You can binge watch all of them if you want, or you can just pick and choose the ones that you like.